There it goes, recording. All right, guys, this is an experiment I've been looking for a while for coke and concrete. So if you guys are into coke and concrete, this is going to be a great video for you guys. Um, so in my years, I've been doing concrete for about 20, almost 25 years now. And um, I spend a lot of time in the wintertime if we're not working researching concrete. And what I wanted to find out is by putting sugar in concrete will it ever set now i ask a lot of drivers that and you can research it and look up on youtube but no one has a video on this so what i'm going to do is an experiment to find out if sugar can make concrete not set up so what we have here is brown sugar in this bag i have powerade in this bag and this has uh, this has a lot of sugar in it let's see how many um, 21 grams of sugar. This can of Coke, let's see how many grams it has. Added sugar, 52 grams, um, added sugar is 104%, so 52 grams of sugar in this. So there's a lot of sugar, probably not good for your teeth. And then we got zero, which this doesn't have any sugar in it, um, but I'm gonna put it in there, see if it can do anything, I don't know, just to see what happens. More or less this would be a control. So here we go. We're going to start off by adding the brown sugar. I don't know if I'm going to put the whole bag in there, but let's see here. Now brown sugar or regular sugar. Um, this would be like if I wanted to say if you had a concrete truck and something happened, could you put a whole five pound bag of sugar in the mixer and make it not ever set up so it doesn't ruin the truck? So I'm going to open this up. By the way, this is a cool knife here. I don't show you this knife real quick. It's called a Cobra Tech. It's an automatic knife, double edge, pretty cool knife. You ever looking for a cool pocket knife? Oop, didn't lock that time. Uh, this is a pretty good knife. But anyways, here we go. We're gonna try the sugar thing, see what happens. So first we're gonna dump all the product in there. Here's the sugar, okay. It's gonna be the brown sugar bag. Stir this one all up, see what it does, you know, and then tomorrow we'll see what happens to this. If this is ever going to set. So this is brown sugar, I'm mixing it all up, and I'm going to actually hit it with the vibrator. I got a vibrator over there. So we're going to mix it all up good. It's all mixed up in there. Make sure it's all the way down to the bottom. That one's mixed pretty good. So now here we go. This all has oil. If you're looking at this and wondering what's that stuff there, it wasn't in the concrete. I put oil. These are hydraulic oil. I put it in the bucket so it doesn't stick. So here we are. Here's the Powerade. I'm going to dump the whole bottle in there and we'll see what happens. Coke and concrete, right? Well, this one's Powerade. Mix this in there real good. Well, I don't know the exact mix of how much will stop this. I don't actually have access to a... Well, I do have access to one. Uh, Ted yards of concrete, but I'm not going to waste it for the experiment. Um, this is just a small test, so we could almost figure this out later. Um, at some point in time, if... But what I've heard, this is what I speculate. I think probably two liters per three to four yards of concrete. So you'd probably have to put, um, I'd say probably six liters, I'm guessing. Six liters of uh, Coca-Cola to stop the concrete from and the idea behind this is that concrete will never set and what happens i guess is it it has something to do with the molecular structure of the concrete it, it interferes with concrete at a molecular level and the idea is it'll never set so if you ever had a hot load and for whatever reason i don't know i guess it's kind of just a, an experiment anyways you ever wanted to make concrete not set for 
maybe add a hot load or something, but you, you wouldn't want to put this on your floor or in your wall or something like that because if it does work, then you just ruined all the concrete. And that's what my, my plan is actually, is to ruin the concrete. So we're gonna mix this one up. Now this is, uh, this is the footing. We just poured this footing here probably about a half hour ago. This is 3,500 PSI concrete, uh, five to seven percent air because it's outdoor concrete. 3,500 PSI, no accelerator. It's going to be about 65 today, so we don't need it. And um, that's three-quarter inch stone. You can see this has three-quarter inch stone in the mix. If you look real careful, it's going to have stones in it. So I'm going to mix this one up real good. Make sure it's trying to mix it all the way to the bottom and tomorrow we'll come in and you can see that concrete we'll film tomorrow see what if that concrete's hard that'll be green but uh, it'll be set up and hopefully none of these are gonna be set up so we'll find out mixing it real good this one I don't think is gonna do anything because it really doesn't have any sugar so this one's probably gonna set up that's my prediction. It seems like I got it mixed. I can feel the whole bottom. It's mixed in there pretty good. Just to make sure, we got a Makita. This is a Makita. I think it's an 18 volt, maybe 20 volt. So we'll try this out. See what happens. You can see it's kind of mixing it all in there good. So this is the one that I think is zero, gain rate zero with no sugar. I don't think that's going to do anything. I think the coke is not going to set up. But we'll see this tomorrow, see if it ever sets up. And here's the brown sugar. So now we're going to just put this bag in here so we can check tomorrow. This yellow bucket here, fluorescent one, that's our brown sugar. Here's our Powerade. Let's set that one here. This is our Coca-Cola one. This one's probably going to be the best one, then followed by this one. This one probably, I don't know, I would think this one's going to be pretty good too. And I predict that this one's not going to do anything. This one will probably be pretty hard tomorrow. And uh, if you guys got any questions about this, um, I'm going to show you the part. Part two is going to be tomorrow. So this is part one. Part two tomorrow. We're going to come back and see what happens to the test results. And uh, remember to like and subscribe. I, and what I was saying is, I don't think there's any videos on YouTube. There's no videos on the internet that I could find that says anything about this. So I think this is a pretty cool video. If any of you guys that do concrete, you guys are floor guys. Uh, flat work guys, stamp concrete, whatever, uh, maybe even a driver, an engineer, anybody that cares about concrete or works with it, this would be kind of a cool video because nobody knows really much about it. First guy out there to do it, so hopefully this video takes off a little bit, and you guys remember to click like and subscribe and comment down below, help me out guys. Um, I'm trying to get as many subscribers as I can, so if you find this video interesting, Share it with your friends and help me uh, get more subscribers. Once again, thanks. Uh, the company is Central Mass Concrete Foundations. We do pretty much anything concrete related and we do site work also. So uh, if you need any work, give us a call too. You can find us on Google or Yahoo. All right, thank you and have a good day.